is Miss Lavon. Please help me. What can I help you with? Why is my sentence wrong? I wrote after working at the construction site. My father has bread and butter. The sentence should be: Working at the construction site is my father's bread and butter. Huh? What does this mean? In fact, my father usually has bread as a part of his meal. It's totally true. Why? <coughs> Hello everyone, I'm Lavon from Lango. Have you encountered any phrases like that? Today, to help you get to know more useful phrases, we are going to learn some interesting binomials. Is it near to you? A binomial is a noun phrase with two heads joined by a conjunction, in which the order is relatively fixed like bread and butter. All right, let's start. The first phrase we have today is aches and pains. We can easily understand the meaning of this phrase. For example, my mother seems to be worn out from hearing about my aches and pains about my studies all day long. What do you think of when seeing this image of pins and needles? Pins and needles, it's something that causes unpleasant sensations when walking on it. So, this phrase means you are nervous or excited about something that's going to happen. For example, the groom is on pins and needles waiting for his bride to walk down the aisle. The next phrase is demonstrated by two familiar images of bread and butter. Bread and butter is synonymous with livelihood. Creating content on social media is my bread and butter, yet I'm switching to another field because it doesn't suit my skills. Are you familiar with the following phrase? From rags to riches. It refers to going from being very poor to becoming extremely wealthy. She turned from rags to riches after being crowned and awarded a large sum of money. The following words might remind you of mechanical things or machines, right? Nuts and bolts. It refers to the basic and practical facts of something. When it came to the nuts and bolts of running a business, he was clearly unable to cope. Next up, we have an evocative phrase, old and grey. If I have to wait until you get rich, I'll be old and grey by that time for sure. Rise and fall. Can you guess what it means? It refers to the up and down changes of someone or something over time. The singer's rise and fall was portrayed by his journey from young famous singer to his despair after a series of failed albums. The idiom ham and eggs refers to two things that suitably go together. Mike and James have been like ham and eggs since the start of their four years studying at university together. Do you know the meaning of the following phrases? Rise and shine and fair and square. Rise and shine is used to wish someone happiness upon waking up. Rise and shine, it's going to be a beautiful day. Fair and square. That means something is done honestly and fairly. Despite lagging behind in the first round, she won the competition fair and square in the end. That's the end of our lesson today. If you want to sign up for IELTS courses here at Lango, then please click on the link below. Our IELTS courses are designed to cater to your individual needs and to provide personalized learning pathways. Remember to like, share and subscribe and please don't forget to hit that bell button to get notifications of our latest video uploads. I'm Lavon from Lango Learning System and hopefully I'll see you soon for the next video.